Hello, this is Michael, and welcome to the Medlock Method Chinese Language Builder. 你好，我是邱老师。And this is part four of food and drink. That's right. 吃吃喝喝。And what are we going to be learning in this? Today we are going to ask for more things. For example, side dishes, and more dishes, or or sauces. Okay, very useful. Yes, and we do a little bit complaining as well. Sometimes you have to whinge, don't you? No, we never whine. We only state the fact. Here, listen, please. 要不要来点冷盘？哦，要不要再来点冷盘？ The、冷 is cold. Yeah, and 盘 is dish, a plate. So cold dishes, perhaps. That's right. <laughs> Very clever. 冷盘，要不要来点冷盘？ Do you want? Okay, would you like some、uh, cold dishes? And these would be a small sort of starter dishes that you normally、they're、get starters, in the Chinese meal. They're starters usually.、Mm. Yeah, they are starters. Okay, and it's cold, so why the guests are waiting for the food to be、uh, prepared, and they can start eating a little bit. You know, not just hanging around there. And they are lang pan. They are prepared, so they are cold. Lang pan, and 再来一点冷盘再 is again. It means that you have ordered some already. Oh, so this is actually saying, "Would you like some more?" That's right.、Mm -hmm. Okay, 再来冷盘 Well, shall we practice this pattern with some vocabulary that、um, people probably know already?、Mm. Firstly, can you remind us how to say green vegetables? 青菜 Ask me, would you like to order some green vegetables? And do you remember how to say drinks? In now. Ask me, would you like to order some more drinks? Want to order some more drinks? And I'm sure you remember how to say tea. 茶 Ask me, would you like to order some tea? Not necessarily order. When you say order, you have to pay. But、uh, sometimes at、uh, restaurants, tea is free. In this situation, you can also say 来点 Okay, bring some over. 要不要来点茶 Now next, we're going to ask for alcoholic drinks, and then you just say alcohol, don't you? That's right. That would be xiao. Ask me, would you like to order some more alcoholic drinks? 要不要再来点酒 And do you remember how to say juice? 果汁 Ask me, would you like to order some juice? 要不要来点果汁 And finally, the staple of any southern Chinese meal, white rice. 白米饭 Ask me, would you like to order some more white rice? 要不要再来点白米饭 ？Like 茶，白米饭 sometimes is free in some restaurants as well. It depends. Sometimes you have to ask for it in China, don't you? That's right. Yeah. But not so much in Taiwan. It just sort of comes, doesn't it? Usually in Taiwan, it comes with the meal.、Mm. Yes, and it's and in Hong Kong as well. It's, it's like that. Free, but、uh, it depends on the restaurant, though. Yeah, the more you pay, the more you have to pay for the things that are free <laughs> in other restaurants. <laughs> okay, next sentence pattern. 还要点什么别的吗？还要点什么别的吗？ Dn is order again, isn't it? That's right.、Okay. Very confusing for us. So many different words. <laughs> Dn is order here. 还要 Okay, so still want. Dn order 什么别的 Whatever other things, P 
Piede is other things. Yeah, other stuff. Piede. So the best way of translating this would be, would you like to order anything else? That's right. Mm -hmm. 什么别的? Anything else. Okay, anything else in Chinese is 什么别的? There are some alternative ways of saying this, aren't there? Asking yeah. this, should I say? Yeah. For example, this is for eating. 吃, 吃点什么别的吗? 还要吃点什么别的吗? So do you still want uh, some other, eating some other, try some other things? 吃点, and 点 here is a bit. Bit. So the, would you like to try to eat some other bits? <laughs> <laughs> some more, to eat, try some more other things. Yeah. Okay, 吃点什么别的吗? And as we said before, we use that all the time, 来. 来点, and order a bit some other things. 来点什么别的吗? And of course, you can say 点点什么别的吗? So it's a little bit some, awkward though, isn't it? That's yes. right. So when you use 点 as order, and you just forget about 点 bit. One more time. 还要点什么别的吗? Or sometimes you ask 还要吃点什么别的吗? And using 来, 还要来点什么别的吗? Okay. Let's go through some answers then, shall we? Yeah. Now, often you'd want to say, especially in China, enough, because you've got a table heaving with things to eat. Yes, yeah. So first, can you remind us how to say the word enough? Go. So how do you think you would say, no, that's enough? And of course, typically you might want to tell someone, if I want to order some more, if it's not enough, I'll order again. So let's break that up a little bit. Can you remember how to say order again? Now we're going to say, if not enough, we'll order again. You don't need to use the if in Chinese, do you? No, we don't. So it's literally not enough, again oh, order. That's right, yeah. 不够再点, 不够再点. So Chinese is very easy, isn't it? You don't have to say if and then. You just say, not enough, order again. But it's confusing for us. We <laughs> want to add in these words. We <laughs> keep 不够, leaving them out. <laughs> yeah, 不够再点. And here is mainly, uh, you said it to the um, uh, waiters or waitresses, they ask you, do we want to order some other things? Okay, then you say, 不了, 够了. That's a bit more blunt than the yeah. other one, which will be coming up in a couple of yeah. Uh, goes. Yeah. Of course, you might just want to say, that's all. Now, the Chinese way of saying will be, just these. That's right. And just is, 就, 就这些, 这些. 些 is like 点, it's a bit, 这些, these, okay, just these. Now imagine that we're talking to your host, and bula gola is just a little bit too aggressive, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, but when you are, your host is asking you, would you like to try some other things, would you like to have some more, and you usually would not say bula gola, unless you're the boss. <laughs> <laughs> How would you say that? 不用了,够了. Ah, no need. Yeah, no it's need. Enough. Yeah, enough. So it's softer. 不用了,够了. This might be followed up with a don't waste something. Yeah, with especially the old people, you know, the elderly, they, they try to tell you don't waste. 别浪费. And the 浪费 is the waste. That's right. And 别 don't. 别浪费. My mum always says that. <laughs> Being a Yorkshireman, I fully appreciate the uh, sentiment there. Right. <laughs> so Yorkshireman, um, 不浪费. 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 不浪费 means? Don't waste anything. Yeah, someone is a frugal. Absolutely. 不浪费, yeah. We're careful with our money. That's what we call it anyway. Okay, let's do some practice here. Using 点. 
ask me, would you like to order anything else? Tell me, enough, that's all. Ask me, would you like to eat anything else? Tell me, no need. Tell me no need, it's enough. Using lie, ask me, would you like anything else? Tell me no need, it's enough. If there's not enough, we'll order some more. And you might want to add on, don't waste. Okay, next sentence pattern. 还有什么下饭的菜? 还有什么下饭的菜? Underneath rice? <laughs> <laughs> 下饭的. 下饭 is an, um, the kind of dish can the... Complements rice, doesn't it? It sort of soaks up the juices and things. Yes, and it cannot get the rice down. That's why it's called 下饭. Ah, so it makes the rice more palatable. You're not just eating boring white That's rice. That's right. Mm. Yeah, I think there's a traditional story, you know, the background to it, because traditionally the whole family share... Uh, a big bowl of rice and not much else. That's right. And then you need you need to have something that can, can get you to, to eat more rice and then you can get full up quickly. You were going to say fatter, weren't you? <laughs> 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 it's a modern standard, but uh, before it's Sha <laughs> Fan. Okay, so here, Hayo Shama Sha Fan the Tai means uh, still have Shama, whatever Sha Fan the Tai. Okay, so something can uh, bring the rice down. Uh, okay, so you've still got a lot of rice in your bowl and you're thinking you don't want to. You don't want to Lang Fei. Yeah, could be so that. So you want to order something to go to help you eat the rice. Could be that, and could be that uh, ch your children probably, you know, do not have a good eating habit. Never come across that situation. <laughs> no. So you want something xia fan, so kids can bring the rice down into their tummies. Okay, xia fan, that's high. Well, let's work on that sentence pattern with a few other things. Yeah. Do you remember how to say not spicy? Bu la. Bu la de. Ask me, are there any more non-spicy dishes? Now you're going to introduce a new dish for us, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Dong Po Rou is a kind of dish with meat or pork actually in the in a in a small bowl with a lid. Yes, it's a kind of stew thing. If you go to Hangzhou, there, it's, a, the, it's the local speciality there, That's isn't right. it? It's sort yeah. of like a fatty stew. Pork stew. Pork stew. Yeah, because I don't eat meat, so I don't know. But people say... Stew. I like it, it's very yeah. good. And I yeah, don't normally eat fatty things, but yeah, this but is... Yeah, but they say mm -hmm. the meat is very tender. Mm. And Dongbo actually was a poet, poet and uh, he was very good at... Uh, um, writing cal calligraphy, a very famous person, and he loved it. He loved it. So, so they it... named the dish after him. That's right. Okay, Dong Po Rou. It's interesting. You name the dish after a poet. We name our national dish sandwiches after a gambler. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dong Po Rou. Bu la. Not spicy. Hen xia fan. Okay, let's try it with something else. Do you remember how to say vegetarian? or without meat. 
Vegetarian would be su cai, su cai. Okay, you don't really have to say su de cai, su cai. And non meat, no meat dishes would be mei you rou de cai. Ask me, are there any more vegetarian dishes? Using which one? Su. Hai you shen ma su cai? Tell me no. Mei you. Hard luck, Chiu Lasha. <laughs> There's rice. <laughs> oh, 没有肉的菜 Anything, not really soup, but 没有肉的菜 <laughs> Of course, wherever you're traveling, you get taken to restaurants and you get to eat the fancy food. But sometimes you like to think about what do people eat every day? What do they eat when they're at home? So we're going to ask about home style food. And there will be 家常菜，家常菜 Literally, home often. Yeah, home dishes. often dishes and 家常菜 is that family style, home style. Okay. Ask me, are there any home style dishes? You 什么家常菜 Okay. 有什么家常菜？还有什么家常菜 ？Would be you've had some already. You have some、mm -hmm. already, and are there some more 家常菜 ？Okay. And you're going to give us an example of one. Yeah. And which is 酸辣土豆？酸辣土豆 is a sour, spicy 土豆 is earth bean. <laughs> <laughs> Potatoes, <laughs> 酸辣 potatoes. Okay, 素的 is vegetarian, 家常 Okay, 很不错，很好吃，很不错 It's not bad, 很好吃 delicious. Okay, now we are doing complaining. 怎么那么慢 How come so slow? That's right. 怎么 How come 那么那么那么 is so. A man slow. 怎么那么慢 So using this theme, we're going to ask a waiter how much longer our dish is going to be. That's right. Yeah. But we'll do it in the Chinese word order. Okay. Which would be, waiter, our dishes still need how long time? That's right. Yeah. Let's build that up backwards, shall we? So Chiolasha, can you tell us how to say how long time? 多长时间 ？And still need how long time? 还要多长时间 ？Our dishes still need how long time? 我们的菜还要多长时间 ？And finally, waiter, our dishes still need how long time? 服务员，我们的菜还要多长时间 ？You're going to ask the waiter or waitress, trouble you to push it along.、Mm -hmm. How would you say push it along? 催，催一下。And trouble you to push them along? 麻烦你催一下。Tui is to hurry up someone, you know, to tell someone hurry up, hurry up. That's tui. Let's just practice these two now before we go on any further. Ask me, waiter, how much longer are our dishes going to be? Waiter, 我们的菜还要多长时间 Tell me. Trouble you to push them along. 麻烦你催一下。The waiter would always say, "Coming immediately." Yeah,、so、immediately on on, on your horse. horse. <laughs> 马上来了。Or they might, of course, say, "It'll be ready in five minutes."、Mm -hmm. 
The Chinese word order for this would be again wait five minutes, then ready. So we'll build that up backwards again. How do you say then ready? Wait five minutes, then ready. Finally, again, wait five minutes, then ready. Now, this is a useful dialogue that you might be using every day while you're in China, so let's practice this, I think. Okay. Ask the waiter or waitress, Waiter, how much longer are our dishes going to take? Tell me, trouble them to push it along. And the waiter is going to reply, coming immediately. Or he or she might reply, it'll be ready in five minutes. Can see you're getting pretty fluent in that dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next one. Another complaint. Okay. 这道菜没熟。Some people say 没熟，some people say 没熟。It's not cooked through, not done properly. That's right. Doesn't happen very often, but it tends to be. I think for Fish. North Americans, Western Europeans, we like to see no traces of blood in our meat. Yeah, it, it can happen um, mainly. I think with the chicken dishes, yeah. the Chinese people have the chicken. Especially the bone bits, it's a bit still red. Yeah. This dish is not done properly. So, this is introducing the general complaints that we might yeah. be using. Yeah. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to ask them to cook it through some more. Yeah. Let's break it into two parts. First part, again, cook it some more. And. Because we are complaining, 没熟, so we use it in the sentence, 再做熟一点, 再做熟一点, so cook it through a bit more. And the way we would ask would be to say, trouble you to cook it through some more. 麻烦你们再做熟一点, I put 你们 here because um, waiter doesn't really cook through do the cooking, so you in, in, including the kitchen, mm -hmm. yeah. And another common problem, not for you because you don't drink beer, but uh, <laughs> me, is that the beer is more room temperature than it should be. <laughs> <laughs> so you might want to say the beer isn't cold. First, can you remind us how to say isn't cold? Okay, in English you might say cold. But in Chinese, you have to be more precise. Bing, Bing means iced. Iced. Okay. 这啤酒不冰, because you really want to put it in the Bing Xiang, in the refrigerator to make it Bing. So, of course, we'd have a follow on request, and it would be trouble you to change bottles for a cold one. Mm -hmm. Let's break this up into bits. Mm -hmm. How would you say a cold one? Bing de. And change bottles for a cold one? Huan ping bing de. Lai. To bring over, yeah. Huan ping bing de lai. And let's put it all together with a trouble you to change bottles for a cold one. Ma vani huan ping bing de lai. Bing de is bing de pi jiu. So ice cold pijo, okay, and ping is a counting word for counting bottles, okay. So huan ping ping de, 
So to change for a bottle of ice one. So let's put both of those together to make a full sentence because it's so important. <laughs> yeah, for Michael. Tell me, this beer isn't cold. Trouble you to change bottles for a cold one. And now it's the opposite situation. We're going to complain that the rice is cold. Mm -hmm. So how would you say that, Cholosha? This rice is cold. And we're using the shi de to emphasize mm. it is cold. Okay, lang is cold. Bing is ice cold. Okay. 这米饭是冷的。We're going to ask, please heat it up. How do you say heat up? 热, 热一下, make it softer. Yeah, 热. It's almost the same as us. Yeah. Hot mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Tell me, please heat it up. 请你热一下。Situation you might come across, many of us in North America and uh, Northern Europe are a bit squeamish about the insides of animals. That's right. <laughs> We're going to say, this dish has intestines in it. Mm -hmm. How would you say intestines? 内脏. And that's not necessarily just intestines, as it is kidneys and it could other be bits. Insides, should I, should I say, just insides, 内脏, or the organs, 脏 actually means organs. Okay, so inside organs, ne zang. So how do you say this dish has intestines in it? So that's literally this dish inside has insides. That's right. Okay, 这道菜里有内脏. And this has happened to me several times. I haven't realized what I've been ordering. Well, you know, we Chinese people, we do not waste. No, neither do we. We just sort of make it into something that we don't recognize. <laughs> <laughs> it's called sausages. <laughs> we just use it, um, you know, to flavor the, the vegetables, flavor qing cai. So we're going to add a request to this. We're going to say, am I allowed to not want it? That's right. It means that you want to have this taken away and not paying. Am I allowed not want? Okay, Can we just forget about that? I'm not paying for this. And often they're very good about it, actually. They just think you're a strange Western person and that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> So they're very flexible Chinese people, aren't you? Uh, maybe because they don't have enough language to make you understand. They say, oh, forget about that. Save the trouble. <laughs> okay. Next sentence pattern. 请再来点小菜. Little dishes. Yeah. 小菜. It's like a side dishes. 小菜. Okay. 请再来点小菜. What's the difference between these and lung pan? Lampan usually bigger. It's uh, like in one of these major courses, but it's just pre. Oh, these are the it's ones in these really small dishes, then will yeah. be the shao cai. Shao cai is more like the side dishes, a little... A little bit of tofu or something. Or seaweed, mm. or dou gan, uh, dried tofu. Okay, on um, peanuts. Okay. Okay. So we're going to be asking for some more things, not necessarily xiao cai. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to ask for some vinegar. Maybe you're eating jiao zi and you would like to have some more vinegar. Can you remind us how to say vinegar? Zu. So some vinegar. Dian zu. Qing zai lai dian zu. Please bring some more zu over, some more vinegar over. And we have a new word, I believe, which is very useful. Garlic. Suan. Suan. Tell me, please bring some more garlic over. 
请再来点儿蒜。And another staple of Chinese food, ginger. Jiang. Tell me, please bring some more ginger over. So this is the、uh, jiaozi meal, isn't it? Ah,、uh, could be, yeah. But no, northern Chinese do not eat jiang with jiaozi. They don't. All、oh, right. Don't, yeah, southern people are using jiang more. And the essential part of any Chinese meal will be something to eat it with, and that will be chopsticks. Quiets, and then you cannot say some quiets. It will be a pair of, isn't it? Yeah. 一双筷子 Tell me, please bring over another pair of chopsticks. 请再来双筷子 And a lot of time you don't have to say e. 双 they just simply say 双，请再来双筷子。And a cup. 杯子 ，and the counting word is 个。Tell me, please bring over another cup. 请再来个杯子。And lastly, bowl. 碗。And the counting word is also g. Tell me, please bring over another bowl. 请再来个碗。请再来个碗。So lie itself is bring over as well, not only order. Yeah. Okay, here.、So、end of the feast. Okay, you have a leftover. 能帮我打包吗 ？Are you able to help me pack? This is doggy bag. That's right.、Mm. 打包，打包 ，doggy bag， 打包。能帮我打包吗 ？And of course, usually they will say no. Okay, 当然 ，of course， 当然。So we're just going to go over fairly typical situations of typical vocabulary that you need at the end of the meal. That's right. Yeah. Unfortunately, they tend to want to have payment. <laughs> so you need the the bill or the check if you're American. Okay. 买单，买单 Literally, the buy list. <laughs> yeah, but but actually, it's from Hong Kong, and that they call it 买单 And you might have some issues with the、uh, my dan, so you might want to ask, "What's this for?" Yeah, in Chinese, it's more blunt. We said, "This is what kind of money? What kind of what kind of money is this for? This is what kind of money?" Okay, and you're not embarrassed about. Going through the receipt at all? British people、no. are Americans a little bit. I know German people aren't. They、uh, go through every single item of the receipt. Very、yeah. much like Chinese. Yeah, yeah, we are practical. Oh yes, it's your money. Yeah, why not? Although I don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> you may, of course, want to have an official receipt to take back and claim your expenses. Yeah. So you'd ask, trouble you to issue a receipt. How do you issue a receipt? Okay, here is 开发票，开发票 So you open a receipt. Yeah, 发票 is official, like in turn, how do you call that? It's official receipt. Okay, 开发票 M. 麻烦你开发票 ，trouble you to issue the receipt. Okay, 发票 Now there are two different kinds. One of them would be a personal use one. And how would you say want to issue a personal use? 要开个人的 Okay, you might be asked. So do you want to issue a personal one? Yeah, 要开个人的 for personal usage. Or a business one. That's right. 还是单位的，单位的，单位 is a is from the 
it's literally means a unit. It's your work unit one because yeah. pre previously up until sort of twenty years ago or so. Yeah. Yeah. People had a work unit. Yeah. Okay. Down way. I should down way. So one of them would be more official. Is that correct? Or one of them just be more for your records? Just different. Fabia is the same. Fabia is the same. Your kaigeren de has to down way de, and so for down way de, then you can you can bring it back and to claim the money back. And geren de is for your own reference. And but there's another one is soju. Soju is a so um a small business. They have only small receipt, and which is it's a non-tax receipt sort of thing. That's isn't right. It? Okay. And finally, because so many small restaurants pop up, they don't do things like issue receipts. That's right. So、okay. they say, "Sorry, we don't have receipts." 对不起，我们没发票。对不起，我们没发票。I think according to the law as well, the small business they do not have to issue. 发票，发票 is official receipt. I think this is true in many countries that small businesses don't have so many、uh, regulations. Yeah, so、file. they have、uh, some kind of personal, um, soju for your record. They call this 收据，收据 which is not 发票，发票 is in small national,、mm -hmm. uh, one official one. So this is the end of this、uh, lesson. Okay, and now it's time for us to say 再见，再见。Have fun.